and welcome to a brand new episode of Mouse Potato. Last week we gave a break to all the funny people in the world and so even I took a break and went on my way to cherish my long, long vacation. I've actually decided to stay put with my break and let the animals do all the entertainment. But let me warn you, the entertainment will be wild and when there is wild entertainment, there will be incidents that are uncalled for. Dangerous part of the act. And the jaws are open, and the head is in. Okay, I didn't mean to scare you guys. But what I don't understand is what on earth were they looking for inside a croc's mouth? I think being aware of danger and yet playing with it is something we have inherited from our ancestors. Primates, take a look at this monkey, the way he plays around on the lap of death. What a close call, especially when the branch broke and the monkey fell down on the ground. If the tiger had got its paws on him, the climax would have been so different. 
I think the monkeys are not aware of save the tiger campaign. Or maybe we should run a campaign to save the poor tiger cubs from these monkeys which torture them. Now look at this guy who runs his own campaign, save the deer. Save the deer from the cheetahs? <laughs> wow, only you could have come up with that, brother. I'm sure the cheetahs are going to go on a hunger strike soon against your activities. But there are some lazy cats which do not even move a whisker but still get fed. Thanks to some dumb, dumb, da dumb, dumb gazelles. Now, no real campaign can actually save a dumb gazelle like that one. What a life the king of the jungle has. Just sit down, relax and get your food served on a silver platter. Now, I think there should be a synergy between man and animals. We should all live by the saying, live and let live. Well, that's a super cool attire, but the only problem is it will not be suitable for the Chennai heat. Well, it's also getting hot in here. I'll go get myself a chilling drink. You guys stay right here. I'll be right back.